can you tell us, can you share one of the most powerful prayer stories, prayer case studies that you've had experiences with, with prayer um, that you just share with people? Well, I have always, on my mission trips, prayed for God to draw the lost because that's my heart in evangelism. And I remember um, one experience where I had prayed and I had really felt specifically burdened. And it was in Haiti? Was yes, it was okay. in Haiti. And as I was sharing with people, we had two young men that came up that really had no intentions of stopping. They were just checking out the Americans. But as I began to talk with them uh, and share the gospel, I could tell that they had probably a little bit more than most of the Haitians did. And one of the sons said to me, one of the brothers said, uh, you tell me something this Jesus can give me that my father can't give me. And I immediately in my heart, the story of Lazarus. And I shared with them and both of the boys were saved and afterwards, they shared with me that they were the sons of the voodoo priest in the village, Whoa. which is just something that it's just close. isn't likely to happen. And I knew it was God. I knew I had nothing to do with it. So I, I have seen prayer work in many areas, but I know, I know God hears our prayers. If he doesn't, his word is not true. Yeah. He either does or his word's not true. And um, he hears the prayers of his children. So I just... That is the whole purpose of this, is to come out and us join our hearts in prayer and come before God the, the sins of our nation and to, to cry out to Him to heal our land, to change this situation.